time to fire up the plow truck. We've been getting a little bit of snow, but it hasn't been fired up since way before the cold spell. And it's still pretty cold, just about minus 20 Celsius right now. So when you live off grid, block heaters are a power sucker. So yeah, we'll go up there and get it plugged in. Let's go see. Honda. Yeah. Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> it's new, so I don't know. It should go good. What are you doing, Chris? I'm gonna plug this truck in. It's minus 17 this morning. Yeah. And this poor old international probably have a hard time. So we'll plug her in, let her warm up for a while, and perfect. We'll start her. Oh, it's amazing. I love this. Beauty. So how long do you think you're going to leave it plugged in? I think probably a couple hours. It's a big block in that big diesel, so yeah, maybe a couple sense. hours should do. We'll see. Come back and check her. Then we get to go snow plowing? Yeah. We're going to burn some brush first. Okay. Let this warm up and we'll burn some piles. Awesome. So up here in northern Canada, you got to get serious about snow removal. Yeah, or you'll get buried <laughs> alive. Buried alive. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, we'll show you a short little clip about how we get things done here at our off good property. Thanks for coming, guys. Colder than I thought. Oh, it's cold. I should have worn more clothing. Yeah, 30 kilometer an hour wind chill. Mm. Yeah, right. It's snowing quite a bit. I love it. We have a bunch of uh, brush to burn because when we put in our property last summer, or when we put in our house on the property last summer, there was a ton of clearing to do. And you can't burn brush in the summer generally because we already have too many forest fires. <laughs> and we live in a forest. So now is the best time to do that while it's cold and there's lots of snow on the ground. But it feels like we're burning a brush pile once a week. On Sundays, I always try and make something sourdough. And today, I'm just making a couple loaves of bread. I really love it. It's fun. I don't know if you guys have tried making sourdough before, but that's what I'm doing. I just left Chris up there because I wasn't dressed properly. So I'll come down, throw a couple loaves of bread in, uh, switch the laundry, and get some proper clothes on, and head back up.
Well, that happened fast. Like a half hour. It's pretty much half burnt. Be nice to get that all cleaned up before spring. I just came down to check my bread I, and I totally forgot the tripod so I'm using my phone so the lighting's terrible and I have to hold it. Sourdough's done, it looks magnificent. I can't wait to have some sourdough. It'll fire up? Yes. All right. Good for a week, maybe? Three days? Something like that, yeah. Now what? I'll check the water level. Oh yeah. I think that's probably good. Okay. Yeah, we have a well, which is super lucky. And Chris just fills the cistern with the well pump, and then we use the cistern, because the original plan was to haul water and fill the cistern, but we thought we'd give a well a try, and we got lucky. <laughs> it works really great. So when the generator's running, like today, I'm doing a pile of laundry so the generator's running because it's, as you can see, there's not much sun. So when the generator's running, that's when we try and run the well pump and just use that power. And I don't know, we've never really ran that cistern below half and it takes us about three weeks to get to half. So that's pretty good.
easier than usual. Let's go. Let's go see how this goes. Usually Chris keeps like a three or four ton of gravel in the box. Yeah. We didn't this time. And now there's a lot of weight on the front. So hopefully this goes good. If not, I guess you guys are along for the ride. <laughs> plowed, sourdough is made. It's been a really great weekend and it's snowing which is fantastic. We really need the snow. <laughs> Good morning. It's adventure day and we're so happy to have you guys along and we got a delicious cup of coffee see you down there going on an adventure it's a beautiful day it's minus 18 we thought we would go check out some local sites today because it's been so cold we've kind of been stuck at home so come along for the adventure thanks have the most amazing meal of your life oh that was so good and the most amazing experience yeah, too they are so friendly harry and barb yeah you guys we just found out that this lodge is for sale and it's actually kind of a steal so i'm going to link the website below if anybody's interested you can check it out it's in northern bc and this lodge was built by timber kings timber kings yeah. like the actual timber yeah. kings pioneer log homes and it's gorgeous. It's beautiful. Yeah. yeah. Very nice place. We're definitely going to come back. But for now, we're going to keep exploring. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for coming along, guys. Let's go see what we can find. We got a lead on something really neat. <laughs>
We just drove a long ways to find this awesome natural water spring. But we didn't bring any jugs. Yes, we did. <laughs> we have one bottle. One bottle. Yeah. So a couple of channels that we watch on YouTube that are also local to our area. Macaroni Meadows and Buick Outdoors have came have come to this spot and collected spring water. Yeah, it looks really clear. It looks really clear. And cold, I bet. <laughs> I bet it's cold. 20 below and it's flowing water. So it's cold yeah. clean water for sure. Yeah, so we definitely wanted to check it out. Thanks guys for filming that video because we wanted to check it out. So yeah, we're here. We'll get some water. Give you a little review. Here goes. I hope it tastes good. It looks good. It's certainly clear. That is nice looking water. That's unreal. Let yeah. me try. Oh, it's so good. It's not hot water. Ah, it's so cold. It's pretty cold. It hurts my teeth. Oh. What is that thing over there? I don't know what this is. I don't know what it is. Olive. <laughs> She's our investigator. Yeah. We brought our chaperone. <laughs> Olive the chaperone. She's busy sniffing around. <laughs> 